what is your problem? Get away from the end, you Do not despair in the face of this violence. Add your voice and your strength to the tide of opposition. I will, for I have longed to serve a cause larger than myself. That's not a legal move. It is a European variation. Arocco. It's interesting, but not exactly fair when you play by different rules than your opponent. You may think differently when you are Sultan. Shall I take it back? Suleiman, I know it has been hard on you watching your father and me quarrel over Bayezid's throne. Grandfather has chosen you, and his word is canon. What is there to argue about? Your father and I were close once, but his cruelty and ambition have made... I have heard the rumors, uncle. Well, I have a meeting with the vizier soon. Shall we continue another time? Whenever you like. Ezio! Tarek has been selling guns to a logo miser, Manuel Paleo Logos. Paleo Logos? That is a sad sound. The last Byzantine emperor was Constantine Paleo Logos. If his heir is arming a militia of some kind, this conflict will escalate. Tarek knows where the rifles are headed. If I find him first, I can follow the weapons straight to the Byzantines. He will be with his Janissaries in their barracks. So if you want to get close, you will have to be one yourself. Not a problem. Guzel. Get the information you need. Then kill him. Are you sure? You told me Tarek and your father were close friends, Suleiman. This is true, but such naked treason against my grandfather deserves death. Daisy.
legendary Constantine, Empire at its zenith. News is just reaching us of a peasant uprising of some kind in the vicinity of the arsenal. There are reports of casualties, but nothing has so far been confirmed. We will, of course, keep you informed of developments. <laughs> Selim understands our plight. The Byzantines, the Mamluks, the Safavid. Only he has the courage to face these threats. Hark, ah, listen. Selim is a warrior, like Osman and Mehmet. So why has our Sultan chosen a cap over our lion? Citizens, beware! A killer stalks Ahmed our street without Ahmed shares the Sultan's calm temper. Targeting the servants they of our Sultan. They are too much alike, I fear. The Janissaries have dedicated their lives to the protection of the Empire. Return the favor and find this killer before he strikes again. Woe betide the murderer who took the life of a beloved Janissary. This enemy of civilization must be found and brought to justice. Get to see something. Say something. Shame on your chakla. I have a lord! Oh, shit! Salamun alaikum, O sublime conquerors. Get out of here, you annoying bird! Why does Ahmed linger in the city? He knows he's not wanted. He is like a moth, hovering around an open flame, waiting for his father to perish, so that he may step to the throne. Did you hear he offered Tarek a sum of money in exchange for our loyalty? God damn you! Kardesh Larim! One of our own was found murdered and stripped of his garments not an hour ago. His body dumped like a mound of rubbish. Keep a close watch on these streets as you move about. Someone is planning to strike in our name. We must be ready. Not personally, but I have seen him. I know he is a remarkable boy. Not a boy, but a capable young man with a magnificent mind. Does he take after his father? Belke. Though I suspect he is another sort of man altogether. Any news from the north? Selim's forces have fallen back to Varna. Heavy losses, I'm told. I pray for a swift conclusion. Yes, but in which direction? I cannot say. My heart sides with our Sultan, but my head hopes for Selim.
Tariq, a message for you. <laughs> Articulare. The rifles have arrived in Cappadoce, where Manuel has garrisoned his army. And our men? Are they still with him? Evet. They will contact us when the Byzantines decamp. Then we will meet them when they reach Bursa. Everything is falling into place, Effendim. Evet. For once. expect would come of such treachery. I blame myself. Not for treason, but hubris. I was preparing an ambush. Preparing to strike the Byzantine Templars where they felt safest. What proof do you have of this? Uh, see, here. This will lead you to the Byzantines in Cappadoce. Destroy them, if you can. You have done well, Tarek. Forgive me. Protect my homeland, assassin. Allah, Ashkila. Redeem the honor we have lost in this fight. Please! <laughs> 
sacrifício para Deus, Deus sacrifício tudo. Don't. start the 96 
Tarek was no traitor, Suleiman. He too was tracking the Byzantines. What? So did you... I'm sorry. God forgive me. I should not have been so quick to judge. He was loyal to your grandfather to the end. And through his efforts, we have the means to save your city. Tarek... He should not have been so secretive. What a terrible way to do a good thing. The weapons were taken to Cappadoce. Can you get me there? Yes, of course. I will arrange a ship to take you. Suleiman! Suleiman! I have been set up and made to look a traitor. Do you remember Tarek, the Janissary? The man you quarreled with? He has been murdered. It is no secret that he and I were at odds. Now the Janissaries will accuse me of this crime. This is terrible news, uncle. When war gets back to my father, he will banish me from the city. Ah, forgive me, nephew. I was not aware that you had a guest. This is Marcello, one of my European advisors in Cafe. Buonasera. Marcello. My nephew and I have a private matter to discuss. As I said, there will be a ship waiting for you when you wish to leave. Grazie, mio principe. We will track down the perpetrator of this crime, uncle. Have patience. I would like a word with you! That could be he. Best have a closer look. I would speak with you. All right. Agreed. Enjoying the poem? Who are these men he condemned to hell? Political opponents. Men who wronged him. Alighieri's quill cuts deeply, no? See, si. It is a subtle way to seek revenge. Ezio. I plan to make a trip to Andrianopoli in a few weeks to visit a new printing press there. That should be fun. It is a five or six day ride from here, and I will need an escort. Prego. 
Oh, I'm sorry. You are a busy man. Sophia, I would love to accompany you, but my time is running short. That is true for all of us. Well, I can try to solve this last code now, but I need to run an errand before sundown. Can you wait a day? What do you need? It is silly, but a bouquet of fresh flowers. White tulips, specifically. I can get you the flowers. There's un problema. Are you sure? It would be a nice change of pace. Bene. Meet me in the park east of Aya Sofia, and we will trade. Flowers for information. You look like a man with money to spend. What do you need, Dostum? Tulips. White, if you have them. Ah, tulips. Uh, forgive me, but I am fresh out. Uh, something else, perhaps? It is not my call, unfortunately. All right. Listen, I may know where to get fresh tulips. You wait here, and I will return. One hour. Two at most. I am not waiting an hour.
What is this? A gift. Sit. Che belli, grazie. I wanted to thank you for letting me play a small role in your adventure. A small role is enough for this adventure, believe me. <laughs> you are a mystery, Ezio Auditore. Mi dispiace. I do not mean to be. It is fine. È affascinante. Sembra squisito. Why, thank you. Any luck with the final code? Ah, the code, si. I solved it many hours ago. You will get it soon enough.
Please help. Find the man who did this to me. I should get you to a Hakim. No. There is no time. The man who did this... He is looking for my wife and my daughter. If he finds them, God knows what he will do. If you vow your justice, Akadeshim, please, do not let that monster harm my family. I will handle these. How are you feeling? My wounds will heal, and my heart is lifted knowing that my family is safe. How can I repay you? Join us when you are feeling well, brother. We could use men with a sense of honor. Evet, I will. Most certainly. They say he screams in his sleep, calling out for his father. Abbas, what a miserable man. It is not our place to judge. It certainly is. If our master has gone mad, I would like to know. Shh. Good evening. Water. Of course. Sit. Many thanks. What brings you here, old man? Pity Abbas. Do not mock him. He has lived as an orphan for most of his life, shaped by his family's legacy. He is desperate for power, because he is powerless. He is our mentor. And unlike Al Mualim or Al Tair, he never betrayed us. Nonsense. Al Tair was no traitor. 
He was driven out. Unjustly. Yes. Is it? Is it you? I heard the rumors, but I did not believe them. I wonder if I might speak to Abbas myself. It's been a long time. Impossible. Abbas uses rogue Fedayeen to keep us from the castle. Fewer than half the fighters here are true assassins. So, where do I begin? With us. You say these men are cruel. Has anyone raised his blade against an innocent? Alas, yes. Brutality seems to be their sole joy. Then they will die, for they have compromised the Order. But those who still live by the Creed must be spared. You can trust in us. You heard the stories around the village. About Abbas and his nightmare? No, no. Altair. What about... People say an old assassin saved the life of a merchant down the valley. They say he fought with a hidden blade. Uh, rumors. I don't believe it. True or not? You say make... Altair is here. In the village? Mm -hmm. Send word to the castle quickly. Assassins! To me! Mentor. Welcome. Shh. Do not want to get him killed. There! Kill the traitors! You are nothing with the Nothing! Follow me to the castle, and spill no blood if you can help it. Decades have passed since we last saw you within these walls. We could use your wisdom. Now more than ever. For you fools, he has bewitched you. Our mentor has returned. My respect, mentor. For a path. I fight for you, for the order. And welcome, you. My blade. welcome back, mentor. Slayer, you go! Die! Always alone, together for victory. Welcome back, Mentor. Mentor. Tell your men to stand down! No! I am defending myself! Would you not do the same? You corrupted everything we stand for, and lost everything we gained. 
All of it sacrificed on the altar of your own spite. And you! You have wasted your life staring into that apple, dreaming of your own glory. That is true, Abbas. I learned many things from the apple. Of life and death, of the past and the future. Let me show you. I can never forgive you, Altair. The lies you told about my family, my father, the humiliation I suffered. They were not lies, Abbas. I was ten years old when your father came to see me. He was in tears, begging to be forgiven for betraying my family. Then he cut his own throat. I watched his life ebb away at my feet. I will never forget that image. No! But he was not a coward, Abbas. He reclaimed his honor. I hope there is another life after this one. Then I will see him and know the truth of his final days. And when it is your time, we will find you. And then, there will be no doubts. An old man, and still he fought to hold our brotherhood together. I would have called him stubborn in my youth, but now I can only admire his courage. The assassins were his life, from beginning to end. He had no other. Satisfied. I knew it. I deal with the utmost discretion. Oh! 
Bombs. Bene, I know what to do. The suspense is palpable. Yusuf, wait. Un favore. Yes? There is a woman running a bookshop at the old Polo trading post. Sophia. Look out for her. She is a remarkable lady. You have my word. Gather your men. This will attract some attention.
Tüm işi yanlış yaptın ahmak. Baştan başla. Don't let him reach the ship. Do you regret anything, Desmond? Like what? Running away, leaving your parents behind, finding a shit job and pretending to be productive. What's it like spending your whole life avoiding hard decisions? Come on. Sure, you're an assassin, but it wasn't your choice. Do you have a point? I want to know. If you regret anything. Sure. I wish I'd been more patient with my parents. I wish I'd listened. And Lucy. Maybe things could have been different if I... I'm not sure. Thank you. For what? For making sense. Sean, you feeling okay? Sure, yeah, yeah, of course. I have left Constantinople and set sail for the interior of Anatolia, to a region called Cappadocia, where Manuel is training his soldiers. If I am lucky, I will not be alone, for there may be Ottoman spies in the area waiting to strike. But, as ever, I put stock only in myself and hold the memory of dear Sophia close to my heart. Claudia, you would laugh to hear the racing thoughts of your brother now. I have come to admire Sophia with more affection than I thought possible. After the death of Christina, something withered in me. But that feeling, that capacity for love, has returned. I adore Sophia, but dare not drag her into this life of mine. Not without fear of hurting her, or driving her away. of an army here, and no signs of Tarek's men.